You're coming off a big win in your last fight. Talk to me a little bit about that fight. Um, I fought Antonio Paraban, um, a very great, great, tough fighter from Mexico. Um, you know, I, I, had, I had faced some adversity during the fight. I was um, hurt in the sixth round, but I was able to bounce back and come back and get the win. A very tough fighter, so um, here we are. You're ready to fight another tough fighter from Mexico again. Um, I, it's kind of hard to say his name. I'll I, I say his first name, but uh, Medina, we call him, I guess they call him uh, Tunky or something, something weird or whatever. But yeah, I know he's a good fighter. I've seen him fight before. Um, he has some power, so I know he's going to come and bring it, and we'll prepare for it. Do you like fighting these fighters from Mexico? Do they bring a different type of style that you like fighting? I mean, at the end of the day, they bring me a name, and I just say, okay, so I'm the type of fighter that fight anybody. I don't really question about who they put me in there with. I know I believe in my skill, so, you know, I, I just go out there and take care of business. With a victory on Saturday, are you ready for that 168 world title fight? I, 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 I most definitely am. I mean, this is my dream. Everybody in this gym has a dream to become a world champion, and I'm right there knocking at the door, so I'm definitely ready. Anthony Durrell just hit Sean Porter. Not Sean Porter, yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, Saki Abiga. Abiga. Is that a, a fighter that you would like to fight? Durrell? I mean, I, I, I would love to fight either either champion, you know? It's not just one champion. They all have belts. Um, he's just the, the, new, the newest WBC champion. Uh, big congrats to him as well. Um, but I, I would love to share the ring with all those guys.